Hi, I'm Anthony from the HPP Group, and in this video I'm going to be demonstrating how you can block email senders within your Outlook desktop client. First, obviously open up Outlook, and navigate to the email that you identify as spam or a sender that you do not recognize. So in this case we'll use a typical Microsoft Azure one from azure-noreply at microsoft.com. And what we can do is we can right click on the email, highlight junk, which is third from the bottom, and you have these options here where you can block sender, you never block the sender, never block the sender's domain, never block this group, and then you've also got your junk email options. If you just wish to block the sender, you click on block sender, and it'll give you a notification saying the sender is your no reply at microsoft.com has been added to your block senders list and the message has now been moved to the junk folder. Anyone that tries to email you from that email address, their emails will go straight into the junk folder. If we just quickly add it back onto the save senders list, and let's explore further options. So again, if we right click, we go down to junk, Let's select junk email options. These junk email options give you a choice of what you can uh, what you can do with emails that you would consider as junk. So for example, at the moment there's no automatic filtering. Mail from blog senders is still moved to junk folder. Then you'll have <clears throat> low, high, and safe lists, all with their explanations here. You also have the checkbox here which says permanently delete suspected junk email instead of moving it over to the junk. However, I would probably advise not to leave this unticked in case there is anything that gets misinterpreted as junk email. You have your safe senders options, which at the moment we've highlighted as your hyphen no reply at microsoft.com as a safe sender because we've marked it as not junk. You have your safe recipients. And then you have your block senders list, which again, as your hyphen no reply at microsoft.com is included in the block senders for this demonstration purpose. You can also add email addresses to the block senders list by clicking on add and enter the email address that you wish to block. And that list will then be populated with the newly added creation that you just made. Now please do bear in mind that this will only affect your email address uh, and your email client as well. This will not have an impact across the entire domain or estate. If you have any further questions, if you get stuck, or if there's any other IT issues that we can help you with, please do drop us a call on 01724 400304 or send us an email to it at the hbpgroup.co.uk. Thank you.